Hi friends, welcome to Fabulous Chef. Today let's see how to make a very delicious recipe with banana flour. So first of all I'll show how to clean a banana flour. This is how it looks. There are various petals. Let us peel it one by one. You can see tiny florets inside. So remove them. We need to rub each floret. You can see a thick stem in the center, which is the pistil of the flower. So we need to remove them. And also a tiny transparent piece, which is the calyx. So remove both of them and discard it. So repeat the same process with each floret and start cleaning. It's quite a time taking process but still it's all worth the effort. The banana flour is full of fiber and it is very good for diabetes and also for digestion. So you can also hold it in bunches and remove so that it would be much easier. Likewise, now here all the florets have been cleaned and kept aside. When you come to the center, you will see a thick white portion. So start chopping it like this till you reach the very end of the floret. The banana flour has to be put in a water containing curd, otherwise it would turn dark in color. So once we have chopped all the banana flour, like this, we need to take a bowl of water and add about 2 tablespoons of curd, preferably fresh curd, mix it in the water and keep it aside. Now let's take the florets which we have cleaned and kept aside, hold it in bundles and start chopping them. Chop it as tiny as you can as shown in this video. After chopping it, add it in the curd water which we have mixed and kept aside. Now let's go into the recipe. Let's see the ingredients. We need cumin, green chili, curry leaves, one large onion chopped, some turmeric powder, some freshly grated coconut, some mustard seeds, some urud dal. Now take a small mixy jar. I have cleaned about two banana flowers. For that I am adding about 5 tablespoon of coconut which is grated. Always use a freshly grated coconut. To this we need to add about 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds. One green chili. And about half a teaspoon of turmeric powder. Now grind it coarsely. You need not add water. It should be something like this and keep it aside. Now take a pan and add about three tablespoon of oil. When the oil is nice and hot, add about one teaspoon of mustard seed, one teaspoon of urad dal, and stir it till the urad dal becomes nice and golden brown. 
now we can add the chopped onions I've taken one large chopped onion and some curry leaves stir it till the onions become translucent now add the chopped and cleaned banana flour and mix all the ingredients together we need not add water as the banana flour releases its water add sufficient salt and close the pan with a lid after about 2 to 3 minutes you can see that the banana flour has released some water and become nice and soggy and soft wait till all the water is dry and nice at this stage we need to add the coconut that we have prepared earlier and mix all the ingredients together till it's nice and dry it would take about 5 to 10 minutes my friends so that's it my friends our delicious and very healthy banana flour recipe is ready do try this recipe like and subscribe to my channel and leave your comments below